Maya, how are you? Goed, met jou? <laughs> met mij ook goed, dankjewel. How is life uh, going at Schalke? It's getting better now. Yeah, beginning of the season was very difficult uh, for me individually and also as a team. It's didn't the result didn't follow, uh, but now recently since since end of uh, January we started to play well, and uh, of course that after that feeling much better now. Because you are fighting to stay in the Bundesliga. Yeah, of course. How big is this club? You can see the stadium is massive and the fans are crazy and. Of course, we have a problem financially. We have uh, not the same like 12 years ago, but still the club is the same. Club uh, philosophy is nothing changed. And uh, as I say, massive stadium and big fans and always the atmosphere is amazing. Then we're going to talk about VVV because that's why we're here. What do you remember when the club called you for the first time? Uh, first time I met High Belden when I was in uh, Nagoya. And then Keske Honda, my friend, used to play and I tried to visit him before I moved to Fenlo because I wanted to see the, the atmosphere before I decide. So that was uh, something in summer. And then I said, yes, it's good for me the first, as a first step. But unfortunately, Keske wasn't here for the national team. Then I spoke with High Bird and I ha we had a cup of coffee and then he said, let's go to Pink Pop, the concert. Okay, the president said this, I have to say yes, I went. It was a nice time, first time, I was very impressed, the, especially not the club, but uh, the personality High Bird and has is something special for me and very, he's very helpful for me. Then offer arrive, I say yes, then that started. That is the first uh, moment. Was it a big difference for you to come to Europe and the Netherlands? Yes, it's massive different, especially not only football, but also culture, language, food, everything different. But I think now I can, see, I can say that was a good first step because uh, Fenlo is not a massive club, so I can try, I can challenge, it's acceptable. and. Uh, of course, this is a big challenge for the club because of the financial problem that rules different. The foreigner, they have to pay a lot. But this is a bit of gamble, but me, Heibeld and Keske also, we made some good histories, good um, results. Also, the Musa went to uh, Cheska Moscow with good money, and that was a uh, good business for the FFA, and also we made as a, as a player, we had a, we got a good ch challenge and a good uh, opportunity to play in Europe first time. Then after that I stepped out, stepped out up to England. That this is what I wanted, that we wanted. So I think this is the right. It was the right project. Was it very different playing soccer in Japan and in the Netherlands? Yeah, a lot because. Uh, Holland is like every most of the team play 4-3-3 in position game and but as I say Fenlo is just bottom or lower team in the LDBG and I used to play in Nagoya as uh, one of the big cl big club in Japan it's the football is totally different and life is totally different uh, everything's new for me, how we eat, how we prepare for the game training and uh, of course the facility is not stop. <laughs> uh, the, the circumstance around, around me was totally different but the most difficult part is I had, uh, I broke my fifth matataso in the first training camp training game and it was like three days after I signed then I was very struggling. I was out for 10 months. It's, that was most difficult for both of us, uh, me and the club. Volgende wissel bij VVV. De ene debutant werd net naar de kant gehaald, maar ook deze man gaat zijn debuut maken. Maya Yoshida, de Japaner. This is my debut. Wow. Very young. Very skinny. <laughs> wow, I'm very skinny. 
What do you remember of this day? I don't. Rem I honestly, I don't remember nothing about this game. Debut. Uh, oh. After like ten months out, I play. So I change with Kevin means I play number six midfield. I think that's also a surprise. Uchebo, Boymans, Musa. Ball op de hak, maar hij heeft hem nog. Musa, Musa, Musa doet het. Musa doet het. Musa doet het voor VVV. What's this moment? Do you know the moment? No. It's in the playoffs. Oh! <laughs> that last means we survived. <laughs> yes, this game I will remember. Yeah, before they score, we score, we are going down, no? Then one goal, then we stay up. Last minutes. <sighs> wow. Do you remember uh, the party? Yeah, I drank so much. I, ha I had to go to the national team, but I didn't care. I drink a lot with Bobby and Fer uh, Ferry they left. Uh, it's an amazing moment. It's it's roller coaster, up and down. <laughs> but in the end, we survived. And uh, yeah, you know, it's, I can see many friends still. Like, I still contact with uh, Ferry they left, for example. He's coming next week uh, against Leverkusen. So, it's not bad. Huh? Still, we have a relationship. The football makes uh, friends. And of course, I still have a contact with the high belt and he came uh, we, when we play a national team game, friendly match in Dusseldorf and I met in last September and sometimes I'm still contact with the club, which is really good. That's, as I say, the football makes a lot of friends in the world. Okay. We have one more moment. I know which one's coming. Volgende gevaarlijke kans, wat een goal zeg! Yoshida, 3-2 zeg! Hoe is het mogelijk? Zelden vertoond! Amazing moment. And also, after that we considered the finish 3-3. <laughs> Was this the best goal in your career? One well, of, yeah. <laughs> But that was not planned, like short corner. And uh, to be honest, Musa was, Musa's cross wasn't good. Because I was uh, late arriving, the ball just came to me. And it's happened. But I can say I'm still flexible like this after 12 years. <laughs> because in Holland, you're still famous about this goal. Yeah, some young player come to me and mention about this goal. And also, after that, I met uh, a lot of players who used to play in LDVG in Southampton because of uh, Ronald Koeman was our manager. And everybody remember this goal. <laughs> it's not bad. Brilliant goal from the Japaner. And in no time gaat VVV van 2-0 achter naar 3-2 voor. You already said the plan worked out for you and for the club because from the Eredivisie, you went to the Premier League. An amazing step. Yeah, it's a big step up. Normally it's not possible, but I was really lucky. But in the football, sometimes luck, luck is very important. But how was it for you to arrive at Southampton as a player from VVV? Nobody knows me, of course, especially to came from a small club and as a Japanese, as a centre-back, England, England history never play like this before, so it was took a long time to got the respect. But game 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 by game, day by day, year and year, in the end, I I have played the seven and a half years in Premier League and especially one club. This that's not common in England. So I would say the step up is. Incredible to be honest, but after that, of course, I had a good time and bad time. Sometimes I play, sometimes not play, but overall, I really enjoy my journey. Still enjoying my journey. After that, I went to Italy and Bundesliga. 
When I left Japan the first time, nobody expecting like this, and even me. So I really appreciate uh, the everybody who helped me. For example, High Belden and the club from uh, gave opportunity Southampton, Serie A, of course, uh, uh, Schalke. So I still enjoy my time. You are also still very popular with our fans. And of course, they are wondering, are they ever going to see you again in Venlo? Maybe as a player or as a fan? As a fan, yes. As a player, no. For sure. <laughs> it's, as I say, it's tough environmental still. I'm 34, 30, this time I'm 35. To be honest, it's difficult to go back. But as a fan, of course, I'm happy to go back, as always. Or maybe as a coach, as a, something special, something different something different position but not as a player <laughs> sorry <laughs> you can cut if you want <laughs> all right um last question is there something you want to say to uh, all people at vv at our fans yeah still i'm very appreciate what they have done for me fans staff and the people who helped me a lot so thank you all and i'll say it's vv